Hello, my name is Andy and I am the Village Idiot, a man with a car and a GoPro and an unhealthy amount of time on my hands. Now, this one, I'm starting outside a church. There it is, it's looking quite magnificent. If I just go underneath this lick gate, you'll get a better view of it. There you go. That is the parish church of St. Stephen. And the board outside here will have you believe it's in Gilbertike, but it actually isn't. It's just over the border into the next parish to the east. Welcome to Newport. So Newport is very similar to Gilbertike in a lot of ways, just looking at the map at least. It's based along the same road that we saw in the Gilbertike episode with everything, generally speaking, strung out along it. But along that road, there is something that's rather interesting, sort of halfway through the village. And when we get to that point, I'll talk to you again. But before that, there's a lot of interesting buildings to see. And the first one is Newport Village Hall, which I'm right outside now.
Okay, so here we are in the center of Newport and I'm stood on a bridge over a body of water. And here it is. Now this is not a river, this is a canal. It's the Market Wheaton Canal, which drains into the River Humber some three and a half miles downstream that way. And that drains into the Humber at something called Wheaton Lock, which is not in this parish. That's actually the, on the boundary between Blacktoft and Broomfleet. Okay, we're going to come away from the main street for a few moments and have a wander around this housing estate which is at the far eastern end of Newport. It eventually loops around and will take us back onto the main street which is a good thing there is still a couple of things I need to see on that street.
Now there are some more of these ponds on the other side of the canal and that's where I'm heading now. The plan is to go to the car and to drive up the west side of the canal and up towards the M62 where it crosses the canal a little bit further up there. And in the process, we'll catch some more of these ponds. So these houses behind me are also within Newport Parish, but you access these by going up another road, which is that way as you look at the bridge here, which goes over the M62 and then loops round and comes down here because Canal Side East and Canal Side West turn into footpaths only when you reach this bridge. Newport Parish Council's logo is a windmill and it used to stand on the banks of Market Wheaton Canal but of course it's no longer there it's been demolished I do however have an old image of it which I found on the internet and that is going to be the first picture in today's picture bit and that's coming up right now Okay, to finish this one off, I've come back out to the west of Newport to a housing estate, which is up Thimble Hall Lane. And I'm just gonna put the GoPro on the dashboard and drive around this to finish this video off.
and that's it for the parish of Newport. Don't forget to tune in every Saturday to see where else I've been in the East Riding and where's next in the series. But for now, I've been Andy and this has been the parish of Newport. I've been the village idiot and I'm out. Mm -hmm.